Shout out Stolen from Africa, second time around. Y'all already know who it is. Rima Major, baby. Stolen from Africa TV. Yeah. <laughs> If I rapped about kids, stuff, toys, and little lions The he say team say drama, then I'd be lying I missed a couple stages, them kitty phases See, I'm my own boss, you be negotiating them raises Trying to be So we're here live, live on location live and, uh, on location. Where are we? King and, and Church? King and Church, yes, King and Church, Toronto so, video Right now up. we are shooting a viral for uh, Single off the upcoming mixtape I'm about to release The song is entitled Father The mixtape is entitled I Am Legends And I'm super excited about it We're just gonna move Tom Real Wolf Productions. I'm the director of this video, Father. It's my okay. business partner there, James. He directed yesterday's video. Okay, okay. Two new Rima Major videos. How was like Rima Major like like to she's work with awesome. you? As, as an Honestly, artist. she's like incredibly professional. We've shot so many videos, and she's the youngest artist we've worked with, and hands down the most professional. Mm. Like for example, today our speakers cut out, and like usually people just flake out, but this girl like remembered all her lyrics and did it a cappella, which was impressive. That's you awesome, never man. see that too often. You know? The concept of the video is, you know, at first I'm praying, I'm sort of like on a bench and um, I'm writing a letter and people kind of think that I'm writing a letter to my dad, like a dad dad. But then at the end it's kind of revealed where I'm writing the letter and who I'm really bringing it to. So make sure y'all watch videos. So really can't, can't reveal that just yet. Not okay. just yet, but um, I just recently came back from Atlanta about like a week or so ago. Um, I just been collabing with a whole bunch of producers, like I did Bangladesh, the business drama, um, a whole bunch of dope ass producers and actually I'm leaving I think tomorrow morning to go to California. I shot a video yesterday, shot a different one today and Cali tomorrow to work. So That's you know it's so been good. Give me the energy to keep going and going and going. So I don't make no rings, no, I don't call at all. DBM oh it's nothing, it's pinning over M calls, no can't have my number, but you sure could have my pen. And pain. if they ain't got a berry, ask them fools just where they be. Cause they taught it. You already know, man. We're going from Africa, G7, Quadro Cinco, C and Tower. You already know what it is, man. We're just wrapping up the father video shoot. Rima Major, look for I Am Legend mixtape coming soon. And this is how we do all day, every day. Toronto, you know what it is, man. We coming, baby. I'm going from Africa. I remember when she once asked me, um, what is what is stolen from Africa mean? Yeah. And I'm like, I don't know. They stole it from Africa. <laughs> and then I went home and I thought about it, and I was just, I, I don't know if I'm right, but the culture, like so much things originated from there. Most is that what is that what it meant? Well, I mean, right? for, I mean, for me, like stolen from Africa is just about how people interpret it, right? I, yeah. I never like to give a, a definition because for everyone it's different, right? Right. That's why you asked. So me I that. just, I just I like throw it out it. there. Okay. But well, I look at it as like the first thing that comes to mind for people is slavery, right? Which is you know true right. but slavery to me is just a branch of that if stolen from africa is a tree then that's just one branch of the tree you hey know man, what i'm saying i understand so that's, dope. that's, that's what's up I man like okay yeah. now i understand so i'm that's like right. why did he ask me that question <laughs> i'm like they stole it from africa <laughs> duh they took it from africa <laughs> okay that's what's up that's what's up <laughs> i love eating at st louis wings and ribs <laughs> all right You also um, participated in the, the, the CBC um, yes, Hip Hop um, Summit. I know it was a celebration of Toronto Hip Hop. celebrating hip hop. And I mean, for like, for, for you to be up there with like some of the, the veterans in the game, how, how was that experience meant to be sharing the that stage That experience, with? you know, I'm just so humbled by it. And if there's one word I can use to describe my overall emotion in terms of everything that's been going on, I definitely have to say just grateful. As a new school artist, to be sharing the stage with, you know, the pioneers of establishment in Canadian hip hop, just to be on stage with them alone is a blessing. So to be a part of that, it was dope. I had mad fun. It was crazy. Hip hop lives in the north, and that day was a prime example. That was the proof. So it, it was dope. All the older heads showed me love. They embraced me. So it was good. It was good. So we're out here right now. Shout us to Stolen from Africa in the building right now. Yeah, we just wrapped up uh, the second video uh, for off the I Am Legend mixtape. It's a track called Father. Uh, well, I think one of the things that definitely separates Rima from other artists is just that that sort of sheer. X Factor talent, and I know that sounds, sounds cliche, but really, I mean, she does, even before I even heard any of her music, you know, she kind of like commands this presence when she walks in the room, and it's, you know, something that's very unique, I find, you know what I mean, that you gotta look out for, and then the music speaks for itself, you know what I mean, and I'll be honest with you, you know, I mean, right from the very first day I met her, <coughs> you know, we listened to a lot of the music, but a lot at the same time, on top of the music, 
you know, just try to get a sense of where she was at, you know what I mean, in right. terms of what her visions were and stuff that she wanted to do. And for a girl her age, 15, by the way, you know, the girls got it together. And that's something that, you know, you gotta look out for, you know. And then, of course, the talent will speak for itself, as you will see when these videos come out. Okay. Look out. That's good. I got a shout out to the whole world. I got a shout out to all the ghetto kids. I got a shout out to everyone doing what they got to do. Keeping God first. Always, always number one rule. Be blessed, be great, and make it happen. Well.